Secret Service will have some questions, probably. This is private property, and you are filming. I'm not going to answer your questions. You got to leave. I don't have to leave, ma'am. There you go. You're going to get a little education. You don't find that a little unusual? Unusual? Yeah. Taking pictures and video? The same way you're filming these cars, they're filming you filming these cars. And that's and, the point. And, and, and it just looks, you know, kind of suspicious. Suspicious. I don't know what that means. No. Why would I go into anywhere private? Oh, no. We just have to tell you. Make sure that when you get in your car, put on seatbelt. Hey, what's up guys? Long Island Audit here, back again with another video. Today we're at the regional airport here in Wilmington, Delaware. We're here today, as always, to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to film in public and publicly accessible areas to promote transparency and accountability within our government and to ensure that our public servants recognize our rights and treat us with respect. Let's get into it. Excuse me, I couldn't hear you. Filming cars. Oh yeah, I'm just taking some pictures and video, sir. And who are you? I'm with the DRBA. I'm What's with that? The I'm, I'm with the airport. That, that's who runs the airport. DRBA. Yeah. And Delaware you're with River Bay Authority. So Delaware River Bay Authority. What I'm asking is, you're in a, you're on private property. Okay, this is for flight safety, and you're filming cars. I'm just, I'm just curious as to why you're doing. Well, I was just walking through the parking lot, taking some pictures and video. You don't, you don't find that a little unusual? Unusual? Yeah. Taking pictures and video? Yeah, of, of, of cars in the parking lot. Well, I was just walking through the parking lot. That's all. In, in, in today's world, I know technology allows you to do a lot of different things, but there is a thing called car theft. And if you ask me, I would like to know, if I was an owner of one of the cars, like I would be out here asking, why are you videoing cars? Are you an owner of one of these vehicles? No, but I am, I work on, I work for the DRBA, and one of my responsibilities is these parking lots. So I do have the authority to ask you, why would you be doing that? Well, anybody has the authority to ask any question they want. This exactly. is America, we have free speech. Yeah, and I just told you, I was just walking through the parking lot, taking some pictures and video, sir. Right, so that seems very odd to me. I know, I know freedom of speech, I, I get the whole nine yards, but I'm just saying, it doesn't seem a little, that doesn't seem a little odd to you that you would be taking videos of cars as much as we've had, as much times as we see on the news with car theft. I'm just gonna keep it plain and simple. That now you find somebody walking around in an airport parking lot filming cars. Have you had any problems with car theft in this parking lot or this airport? In, 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 in Philadelphia, yes, and that doesn't mean it won't happen here. But in this particular airport, you haven't had any history of car thefts? You're, not, you're missing my point. My point is, because it hasn't happened here, that don't mean it can't happen here. Do you understand that point? Oh, sure. Anything can happen at, in anywhere right. at any given so time. what I'm saying to you is you're filming people's cars here, and that's not normal. Do people... That's not normal. <laughs> That, it's just not normal. Bro. I don't think I don't think it's normal for a grown man to come up to another grown man and tell them and, and, and ask them what they're it, doing. It, it, it is normal. It is I don't normal. think that's normal. Normal, normal is normal? subjective, sir. You, you, you want to know why it's normal? Because when things are not, people normalize unnormal stuff in these days. Okay, and what so, you're doing, I'm just questioning. You could continue to do what you're doing because this parking lot is under surveillance. So hopefully nothing becomes of it. So but if it was I'm under surveillance... You, hear me out now. Hear me out. The same way you're filming these cars, they're filming you filming these cars. And that's and, the point. And, 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 I and hope, that's the point, right? And I hope, and I hope nobody has So why would you be worried? Issue, and I hope nobody has If it's under surveillance, car. well, why would you be worried? I, the point of it is, I'm just asking the question. I can freedom of speech. Remember that part? Right, yeah. So you can ask can whatever ask question you, you want. I didn't, I, I'm not no authority where I, I'm saying, hey, guy, you're under... I'm just asking you a question. Right, and I answered your question. Okay. Okay, cool, cool. I'm just letting you know you're under surveillance. Also, we're always under surveillance. There sir. you go, enemy of the state. This right? is the you United. This is the United States of America. Right. There's and, cameras and, and, everywhere. And, 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 and long as and long as everybody has that, right, that understands that. I just want my camera. That's all. I don't okay. trust the government's camera, so I just want my camera to document my experiences. I like that. I like that analogy. There you go. Okay. There you oh, go, sir. You have a great day. Yep. Take yep. care. Okay. Yep. Excuse me. You all right. Yeah. Who are you, sir? 
Corporal. Oh, Corporal Hall, nice to meet you. Yeah, no. I'm just taking some pictures and video, Corporal. Do you mind if I get your name and badge number too, sir? Barry. Barry? Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Oh, my name is Sean, sir. Yeah, nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Brings y'all here today. I'll just take some pictures and video. The facility here, See that's all. you like? See anything I like? Uh, airplanes are pretty cool. But other than that, nah, just taking some pictures and video. We don't got that many here, but if you go out there to Philly, you might be able to get yourself some good planes. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe I will check it out. Just saw it. Get back out here and just do what I need to do. Yeah. If you need anything, just ask me, all right? All right, thanks, sir. Safe. Take care, Officer Barry. Uh -huh. Yep, you too. Stay safe out there. You too, sir. Just Take care. Public, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, of course. Why would I go into anywhere private? Oh, no, we just have to tell you. Yeah, you. that's fine. Typical part of the job. Yeah. Make sure that when you get in your car, put on a seatbelt. I want you guys to stay safe, okay? Absolutely. <laughs> put your seatbelt on, man. Yeah, I'm putting my seatbelt on, of course. Right. It's the law, isn't it, Officer? Of course, I mean, <laughs> I'm just making I, sure that I, I thought so. I thought we were just telling each other, you know, just random hints of advice. That's all. So that's why I said put your seatbelt on in the car when you drive away. Oh, no, nah, I'm, look, you do what you do out here, man. All right, I'm man. having a normal convo with you. Man. All right, man. All right. Sounds good. Take care. You too, man. See, that's the problem, ladies and gentlemen, is that they're friendly, but... It always seems like they have to just, before they leave, give some sort of directive. Make sure you stay in the public areas. Ridiculous. Like I'm gonna go hop that barbed wire fence and be in a restricted area. Who are you? Oh, I'm, un I'm just wondering who you are since you're the one that whistled and got caught my attention, that's all. Yeah, I'm Connor. I'm a assistant chief here at the flight school. Nice to meet you, Connor. Nice to meet you. What you filming? Just filming, sir. That's all. Are you interested in aviation, flying? Like oh, yeah. It's, it's very interesting to me. Yeah, sure. Very interesting. Okay. I'm just taking some pictures and video of the entire facility, though, here, Connor. For what? Oh, just for myself. That's all. For myself. Or for my own, my own uses. Okay. Do you work for, who, who do you work for? Flight Gateway. Flight Gateway? Flight School. Flight school? Okay. Yeah, I'm not not uh, that interested to start any flight schools yet, but definitely interesting facility here, that's all. Gotcha. Okay. All yeah, right. It just looks a, little, looks a little odd, you know, walking around filming everything. That looks odd? Yeah, it just Why? looks, it just looks, you know, kind of suspicious. Coming out to see what's going on. Okay. What about filming outside is suspicious, Connor? Because this is a this is an airport secure. It's a secure ramp, right? This is governed by TSA, right? DRBA. So it's part of our job as employees that work here to monitor security, and make sure that people aren't acting suspicious. Okay. Trying I'd, to get access so you, to somewhere where they I'm sure you've don't have some access. Times where people have done the wrong things with airplanes. Oh sure, yeah. I'm not, but yeah. I mean, no, I know, but you know, it's just our job. <laughs> but people, disrespectfully, sir, people do wrong things with a lot of different items, right? Yeah. Sure. You know, cars, sure. airplanes. There's a whole bunch of different sorts of vehicles or items or weapons that people do wrong things with. Sure, yeah. but I'll tell you one thing: no one ever does anything wrong with a camera. Sure. Right. All right then. Yeah. Take care, guys. Yep. All you right. have a good one. Okay. Thanks, Connor. I'm going to get questions from a lot worse people than you. Oh, yeah. Really? When, when President Biden's in town. President Biden's in town. He will be. Oh, okay. He will yeah, be. So, is so President Biden like some, you know, I know he's the president, but is he scared of cameras? I'm sure he's in front of cameras all the time at press briefings and things. I don't think he's too scared of cameras. No, but Secret Service will have some questions probably. Oh, well, I'll answer their questions if I choose to. Awesome. Uh, but camera, yeah. not a weapon. Yep. Don't perfect. be scared of cameras. Well, Take care, guys. Yeah, have a great day. Yep, you too. I never understand why people are so terrified of the camera of mass destruction. You look extremely familiar. I look, I look yep. familiar? Yep. <laughs> All right. You got the voice? Yep. <laughs> How are you, sir? I'm doing all right. How about you? 
yourself? I'm doing well. Let's take some pictures and video out here. Beautiful yeah. day. Beautiful day out here. Yeah, That's no, all. It's very nice today. It is beautiful. Hope it stays this way, right? Yeah. Oh, it stays this way. I get recognized sometimes, but yeah. not not all the time. So that's cool when I do get recognized, though. So I appreciate it. I watch you, Lackluster. Lackluster, good friend of mine. Yeah. Lackluster. We just started a company called Attorney Shield. I don't yeah. know if you know. I've heard, I've heard of it. Yeah. No, so we I'm just started a company there. Oh, cool, man. I appreciate it. I appreciate right. the support, man. Hi. Hi. How are you? Yes. Who are you? Who are you, ma'am? I'm sorry, Why I didn't get you. Why are you filming? Ma'am, what are you doing? Why are you? Dude, get out of here. You gotta ask three times to leave. Who, who told me to leave? Ma'am, who are you? I, I want to know who you Why are. Why are you filming? Ma'am, I need to know who you are. You just came out here and started speaking to me. For I what purpose? Here. Right, and you work here. You and who are you? I need to know who you are before I answer any of your questions. I work here. And who are you? I am not answering that. Okay, so why, why do I have to answer your questions? Because this is private property and you are filming. It's private property? Yes. Who owns it? The owner. I'm not going to answer your questions. You got to leave. I don't have to leave, ma'am. There you go. You're going to get a little education there. This guy is filming. He's. He's filming. Thank you, sir. Not here to bother anybody. She was a little aggressive. You should probably have a talk with her. Thanks. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Where do grown adults come, like, how do you just come out and just start demanding to ask questions for people, being aggressive? I don't really get it. I don't get it at all. It makes absolutely zero sense to me. What's that for? I'm sorry? What's that for? This is a camera. Yeah, this is a camera. Yeah. What else would it be? Okay. It looks like a camera. I don't know why else, what else it could possibly be. <laughs> Cameras are for recording, by the way. So very small airport here, TSA security checkpoint over here. One airline, rental cars all the way down to the end of the hallway here. So we're gonna be getting out of here. Take care officer, you have a great day, okay? Hey man, you too, man. You still out here? Yeah, man. I'm leaving now. Take care. Hey, you have man. a good one. It's beautiful out there. It's man. beautiful. That's why I stood out there for the long, longest time I could. I know. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't think. I'm not from the area, so I packed the wrong type of bag. <laughs> Take care, though, sir. You too. You stay safe. All right, fellow patriots. So we're just getting out of the regional airport here in Wilmington, Delaware. So the audit started off with the DRBA security officer confronting us and asking us questions about why we were filming in the parking lot over here to my right, stating that I could possibly be breaking into people's vehicles under security cameras as he stated and with law enforcement on the facility premises doesn't seem like a normal thing someone would do but he said that it was abnormal to exercise our rights and take pictures on a beautiful day on public property law enforcement then confronted us asked us how we were doing they identified themselves which was you know very nice and professional of them but they had to just before he left. He was doing so well. We shook hands. Make sure you stay in public property. You know, unwarranted directives are a way of controlling someone. That is uncalled for. And that's why I gave him an unwarranted directive him myself. Because make sure you have your seatbelt on when you're driving home tonight. It's just to prove how silly it is to give unwarranted directives. It's not your job to tell another grown, free man or woman what to do. That's just not the case. And things got really escalated when Connor and the other flight school instructor came out. They said that President Biden is coming, which I don't see how that's relevant to what I'm doing here. President Biden also took an oath to uphold our constitutional rights. So I don't really see how that's a factor here. President Biden is in front of cameras all the time. It's kind of a relevant point to make. But, you know, they said that I have to speak to the Secret Service. We did run into a supporter of ours and lacklusters, which is pretty cool. Always love to run into supporters and we the people. Gives me hope that our country has more than just bootlickers in it. We are millions strong. We care about our constitution and our constitutional rights. That woman, very aggressive, very, very aggressive, wouldn't identify herself, told me to leave private property. She needed to be educated. 
by her superior there on what's private, what's public, what she can and cannot do. Just treat people with respect. Be professional. Treat people with respect. I treat everyone with respect until they don't treat me with respect. And even then, I don't really go off on them, as you guys know. But still, treat people with respect. It's probably the number one rule in life is to just respect people and, you know, be cordial, peacefully exercise your rights. Don't come up to people trying to bark orders at another free man and woman. But anyways, guys, we're going to be getting out of here. Let me know what you think about this one in the comment section below. As always, stay safe. God bless. I'll see you in the next video. Long Island audit. Peace.